All right, hey everybody, Pop Can Dan. Woof, man, back here, back here at the lake. Uh, I came out yesterday, water detecting. I, I already did a video on this beach behind me, but now I decided uh, it's time to go in the water. Uh, yesterday I went in the water, I kind of jumped the gun, had about an hour window to kill. Um, I didn't bring any camera or anything. Now, look, I'm, I'm not messing around now. I got my GoPro attached. Uh, I, brought, I brought my stuff down here and I just had an hour to kill, so I decided I'm gonna go in the water, just do a quick little hunt for fun. And wouldn't you know it, I found a freaking tungsten ring right where my finger is pointing right there, like not far, just on the other side of that rope. And I'm like, are you kidding me, man? I didn't have nothing to document it. I felt so silly. Uh, Cause when you, I guess when you're a YouTuber, you always want to document everything. So uh, I went back to the campsite and had my missus film me and I, I showed the ring and talked about it. What'd you find, Popcan Daddy? my missus behind the camera filming me. Uh, I was water detecting today. Uh, I didn't have my GoPro with me. I should have, but uh, we'll start. I got some yellow metal thing. I don't know what it is. Nothing too exciting. Uh, I got part of a sunglasses. It looks like maybe Elvis's or something. That's pretty cool. I can just imagine what they would have looked like. Let me put that there. whoop de doo um, Show me the money, baby. Well, here's the money. The beach had my money. So I got this in about two feet of water, just a quarter, mm -hmm. regular quarter. Uh, another quarter in about two feet of water. But here's the here's the uh, the grand finale, the bling bling. Look at that. Ooh. That is a tungsten. Um, That's a carbine, carbine ring. Carbine mm -hmm. ring, yeah. I got that. The funny thing was, I got that in a foot of water right near the shore. I was actually walking out to leave when I got that. So yeah. either someone on the shore got really ticked off at his wife and chucked it. And he said, it's over, baby. It's and threw over. it in the water, yeah. Or it was a dad maybe playing with his kid. It slipped off. Slipped off. And then his, went back to his campsite and his wife said, it's over. <laughs> yeah, it's over. She said it's over. So I'm going to look at this ring under the magnifying glass. If there's any kind of serial number, I know some of them do have that kind of stuff. I will go on... Uh, it's the proper code of ethics to go on and try to find the owner. So that's what I'm going to do. And what we will do, I have a suggestion Ooh, from What's your suggestion, Mrs. Me. Popkin? We'll head up to the front gate and we'll see if there's any kind of um, note that someone's lost something like that. And okay. We'll, we'll check. That's a good idea. So let's do that. I know it's not the real thing when you're like when you're finding it right in the water, but so this time I'm prepared. I've got Mr. GoPro. Uh, it's just actually it's just a cheap knockoff, but it's uh, I paid oh, I can't I don't even want to tell you that how little I paid for this camera, and I got everything, all the accessories with it. It's amazing, man. So, anyways, I'm gonna get back in the water. See what I get. All right, enough talking. 